Hello, hello. Hello, David. Hello, Hector. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Enrique. Welcome back, welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back. How are you today? Hello, David. Hello, teacher. How are you? I am very well. Thank you, teacher. And you, how are you tonight? Very good, very good. Back in action. Thank you, David. Hello, Hector, how are you? I'm very good, teacher. Excellent. Hello, Marta. How are you? I'm great, teacher. Awesome. Hello, Enrique. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Welcome. I take, I take my dinner again. <laughs> ah, enjoy. What are you eating? i eating bread uh, and coffee and some beans. Mm, delicious. <laughs> did, you, did you cook or did somebody cook for you? I uh, I cook. I cook it. Uh, my my food. I cook. We when I I don't know when I come to my house. Mm, when I, I when I came came I, I when I came to my house I take my time and I make my dinner. Hey, very good. That's awesome. Okay. Thank you, Enrique. Okay. Excellent. Um, who can tell me what information do you remember about yesterday's class? Who can tell me what information do you remember from yesterday's class? Do you remember the vocabulary? Do you remember this section right here? Actually, I have. Jet. Okay, very good. Hector, I would like for you to be Peter. And I would like for Enrique, you are going to be Mandy. Hector, you are going to be Peter. And Enrique, you will be Mandy. Action. Okay. Yes. Go ahead. I am Peter. That is correct. You okay. are Peter. Sorry, sorry. I understand. I am Marty. Okay. Um, I'm sorry. I'm late. Have you been here long? No, only for a uh, six minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can just see how you ever hate more comfort. Food. No, I. Food. Food. No, I haven't. Is it good food? Good? Is it good? Is it delicious. good? Okay. It's delicious. I had several uh, times. Mm -hmm. Oh, how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I had a lot in Thailand. It's a Technically, add a lot here. I ate. Ate. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Perfect. Now, what I would like for you to do is take a couple of minutes, and I would like for you to practice the conversations in pairs. Practice the conversations in pairs. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, we're Very going to ready. practice in pairs. Let's go. El mismo ejercicio de ayer, ¿verdad? 
Yes, uh, but I don't have the conversation. To say. Okay. Ahorita, ahorita. Uy. Section five. Cinco, five point six. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm Peter. You're Mandy. Okay. 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 I'm sorry. I am late. Have you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide it. I have you ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Oh, how about Thai food? Have you ever had a uh, sorry? I, I okay. have you ever had green, green curry? Actually, I have. I live in Thailand, a teenager, as a teenager. Mm -hmm. I ate, I ate it a lot of there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay. Switch. Switch. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm late. I have you been there. No, I have you been here have long. You? Have, have you been? Have you been? Heroin. Heroin? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide. Have you ever eaten Moro Moroccan food? Uh, no, I haven't. Is, is it good? It's delicious. I, I, have, I have had it several times. Or oh, how about that food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I live, live in, Th in Thailand as a teenager. I hate it a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay. Do you switch again? Yes. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm late. Have you been here alone? Long? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide. I had you ever eating Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Or how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I live in Thailand as a teenager. I ate it a lot there. A lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay. You are fear now. Again. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry, Anne. How you been here long? All right, guys. Now, what you are going to do is you are going to write a similar conversation you're going to write a similar conversation in the discussion forum you're going to go here in the discussion forum and you're going to write a similar conversation like this one here in the discussion any questions teacher Hi. Uh, I I guess I uh, yesterday did did that. 
Oh, you did that yesterday? Yes. Uh, did everybody do it yesterday? Yes. You yes. Finished, everybody finished it? Okay. So we're going to go ahead and move forward and look at the following activity. In this activity, you will the participants will learn when to use the present perfect versus the simple past. Present perfect versus the simple past. Listen, please. Hello to all. In this lesson, we will learn when to use present perfect versus simple past. What we're about to watch is question form in present perfect. Notice the way to answer. Present perfect versus simple past. Use the present perfect for an indefinite time in the past. Use the simple past for a specific event in the past. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? Yes, I have. I ate it once in Paris. No, I haven't. I've never eaten it. Have you ever had green curry? Yes, I have. I tried it several years ago. No, I haven't. I've never had it. All right. Now, in this section, what I would like for us to do is write at least three sentences in the simple past and three examples in the present perfect. For example, have you ever visited Tasumal? I have. I visited once many years ago. So you're going to give me three examples of the simple past and three examples of the present perfect. And you are going to write it in the discussion forum. Are you ready? Okay, yes. let's go. Es decir, cuando... O sea, cambiarlos al pasado. Pues. Mm. Tengo que aprenderme bien. Eso. Ajá, porque se escriben... Bueno, más que todo... Los que son irregulares, supuestamente. Bueno, pero ni modo, hay que trabajar. <risa> Tenemos que hacer tres y tres oraciones. Nos va a tocar entonces una cada uno, si quieren. Uh -huh. eh... Y cómo los compartimos. Yo digo que las vayamos discutiendo. Vaya. Pero yo no las he hecho todavía. <ríe> Así que, si quieres, hagámosla individualmente y nos compartimos. Vaya. Sí. Les voy a decir la que yo ya tengo. Ah, vaya. Ay, aunque son parecidas a las que son los ejemplos. Have you ever visited Mexico? Yes, I have. I have visited in several times. No, I haven't. I've never visited Mexico. ¿Se entendió? Okay, it's perfect. But, o sea, lo has puesto con tu respuesta. Yo no entendí que... O solo eran las preguntas. No, no, no. no. Démosle, completémoslo así como está en la plataforma. O sea, que está bien así. Bueno, pues no sé. Sí, yo digo que sí. <risa> Hagámoslo así, entonces. Vale. <risa> espéreme, espéreme, que yo estoy escribiendo en el cuaderno también. Aquí. Lo que voy a hacer, que ya que tengo, lo tengo en el otro teléfono, lo voy, a, voy a empezar a escribir estas, porque ya tengo dos. Vaya, por favor. 
y así aunque sea avanzamos en eso mientras elaboramos las demás diríamos Héctor en Jasmine present perfect have you ever ate in the park yes I have I have eaten more than one in negative, no, I haven't. I've never eating, no, eating it. That's a way of doing. Ya nos están mandando. Hello, teacher. Hi, guys. Are you finished or do you need more time? More time. More time. I need more time. Everybody needs more time? Yes. Okay, let's go. Yes. Okay, okay. I haven't. I think never. I have any more. Time. No, I have never. ¿Alguna otra? He has listened rock music. Ahorita me la voy a escribir de una vez. ¿Cómo es? He, él, has, listen, ah, listen, 
rock music. Okay. Listen rock music. Respuesta. Mm -hmm. Yes. Y... Yes. He has a music. It has. It has. Listed. Listen, verdad? Yes, this is it. Voy a agregar eso. Vaya, yo puse She uh -huh. has been cooking She has been cooking all morning She has been Repeat please She has been cooking all okay. morning been But cooking. it's a question <laughs> Entonces, she sí. has been cooking all morning And the answer is She has Oh, no, she hasn't. Morning. Bye. The answer? Yes, answer. she has. Uh -huh. Yes, she has. Or no, she hasn't. No, she hasn't. Bye. Voy a agregar esto. She has. Bye, ahí está. Pero no las has publicado, ¿verdad? Porque todavía ahorita, falta ahorita, una. Ajá, ahorita no. Tenemos, llevamos cuatro. Um, I has not only yet. I have. Has not only. Not hungry. Yes. Okay. Pero es has o have? Has. Porque es I. Has porque es como es de mí. Has. Yo creo que es have. I have. have. Ha, la respuesta es has, perdón, 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 sí. Okay, bye. Sí, <ríe> perdón. Mm. Bueno, voy a editar la...
All right, is everybody finished or do you need more time? Is everybody finished yes. or do you need more time? Finished, finished. Okay. Let me have uh, one volunteer. Give me your examples, please. One volunteer. Give me your examples, please. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Let me have your examples. Uh, have you eaten pupusas? Have you eaten pupusas? Uh huh. Yes, I have. I ate pupusas in El Salvador. Excellent. Yes, I have. I have eaten pupusas in El Salvador. Very good. Can somebody give me an example using the simple past? Using the simple past, an example with the simple past. Read the chart. Okay, go ahead. Did you eat pizza yesterday with your family? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. I ate, ate pizza with my family. Perfect. Very good, Dahlia. Thank you. Another example. Uh, Go ahead, Monica. How do you ever run? A race. Mm -hmm. Yes, I wrote someday a race. <laughs> mm -hmm. In that case, will be yes, I have. Have you yes, ever have. have you ever run a race? Yes, I have. Yeah. Okay, excellent, guys. Now we're going to move forward and we're going to look at section five point nine. Section five point nine. Instructions, complete these conversations, use the present perfect and simple past of the verb given. Instrucciones, complete las conversaciones. Use el presente perfecto y el pasado simple de los verbos en paréntesis. Number one, hmm. You ever mm, in a karaoke bar? Have you ever sang in a karaoke bar? Has you ever sang in a karaoke bar? Or have you ever sung in a karaoke bar? Who can tell me what is the correct answer? Have, uh, sorry, have you ever sung in a karaoke bar? Excellent. Very good, Monica. Letter C. Have you ever sung in a karaoke bar? Excellent. Does anybody have any questions referring to this activity? No. All right. Let's go ahead and... Let's do it. Hello. Hello, Dave. Who? who? Respondemos la número dos. Okay. You say the number one, and then I say number two, and Edwin, he says number three. Three. Okay. okay. The you number one with, is with, how... You read the question with the answer. Okay, have you ever sang in a karaoke bar? Is okay, the number, number one. Number two? Yes, I have. I sang one on my birthday. 
Your next season. La, la respuesta de la segunda que dijiste, ¿cuál era? Es la, la opción. Eh, have, no, sí, la opción tres. Ok. Eh, have you ever. Number three. Have you ever. Eh, la primera, the first. Lost. Yes. Lost sometime. Eh, valuable. No, no sé cómo se pronuncia. Valuable. <laughs> Un minero. <laughs> Valuable. Valuable. <laughs> okay, number okay. four. Yeah. No, I haven't. I haven't lost, but my brother. No, I haven't. But my brother lost his camera. On a trip once. Sería okay. eh, number two. Number two, yeah. Question number five. I have you ever gotten a traffic ticket? The answer is first, the first. The first. The first, yeah. Number six. Yes, I have once uh, got a ticket and had to pay um, fifty dollars. Creo que es la opción tercera. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, number seven. Have you ever seen a live concert? Is the option two. Okay, number eight. Yes, I have. I saw you at the stadium, stadium last year. The answer is number three. Okay. Have, have you ever been late for an important appointment? Um, creo que es la opción tercera. Mm -hmm. No. I no. think there is the, the first. La primera, entonces. Ah. Uh -huh. uh, no, I haven't. But my sister was. 30 minutes late for her wedding. Wedding. Sería eh, the option two. Okay. Do you finish it, Edwin? Or... Sí. Okay. Me salió mal a una. <laughs> la mm. primera. <laughs> Pero... Eh, a, a mí sí. The la... la es, Opción tercera era la primera. Sí. Son. Son mm -hmm. sister. Hassan. Sería la segunda. Porque son. Pero la tercera me sale bien calificada. A mí también me salió. La tercera. Sí. Ah, pues, pues se equivocaron porque son. Ok. <risa> <risa> Okay. Bueno, yo voy a decir la creo que have you ever sung? Es la Permítame. No, yo pensé que agarraba las dos, pero no. No, no, porque yo puse la primera y nada. No, entonces es the, the third. Okay, have you ever sung in a karaoke bar? Yes, I have sung. I sang one of my beer. No, pero. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have. I sang one of my on my birthday. My birthday. 
Number three. Have you ever lost some time value? Me tocó otra vez. Okay, number five. Have you ever gotten a traffic ticket? Number six. Yes, I have. Once I got a ticket and had to pay um, 50 dollars. Number seven. Have you ever seen a live concert? Number eight. Yes, I have. I saw you two at the stadium last year. Number nine. Have you ever been late for an important appointment? Number 10. Number 10. No, I haven't. By my sister was 40 minutes late for her wedding. Waiting. 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 Um. You, you listen. What is the correct pronunciation? Wedding or wedding? Wedding. 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 Uh, ¿Quién es el siguiente? Ok, I started with the number one. Have you ever sung in a karaoke bar? Eh, yo con el número dos ahora. Ajá. Para cambiar. Mm, okay. este, yes, I have, I sang one on my, my birthday. Ok, number, number three. Have you ever lost something uh, valuable? <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. Uh, no, I haven't. But my brother lost his camera in, on one on a trip one. Uh, number five. Have you ever got gotten a traffic ticket? Number six. Yeah. All right. Uh, can somebody give me the first sentence, please? I mean, number two. Number two. Somebody read sentence number two. Me, hey, teacher. Hey, Monica, go mm -hmm. ahead. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. I sang one on my birthday. Perfect. Yes, I have. I sang one on my birthday is correct. Marta Menjivar, number three. Have you ever lost something valuable? Valuable, excellent, valuable. valuable. Number four, Roberto. Number four. No. Uh, no, I uh, haven't. Yes. No, 
I haven't, but my brother lost his camera on trip on. Once, on a trip once. <clears throat> Correct. Dalia Santos, number five. Have you ever gotten a traffic ticket? Excellent. Have you ever gotten a traffic ticket? Uh, Jasmine, number six. Yes, I have. I have one. I got a ticket and had to pay $50. Yes, I have. Once I got a ticket and had to pay $50. Correct. Enrique Andres, number seven. Number seven. Have you ever seen a live concert? Have you ever seen a live concert? Yeah. Perfect. Evie's number eight. Yes, I have. I have. I saw you two at the stadium last year. Perfect. Number nine. Edwin. Number nine, have you ever been late for an import, important appointment? Excellent. And the last one, Reina Costa. No, I haven't. But my sister was 30 minutes late for her wedding. Perfect, perfect. Excellent. Does anybody have any questions referring to this section? No, teacher. Okay. Now we're going to look at the following one, which is 5.10. In this session, the use of for and since will be explained throughout an audio. Note the expressions. Listen, please. In this session, the use of for and since will be explained. Note the expressions. For and since. How long did you live in Thailand? I lived there for two years. It was wonderful. How long have you lived in Miami? I've lived here for six months. I love it here. I've lived here since last year. I'm really happy here. Let's talk about for and since. For plus period of time, for six years, for a week, for a month, for hours, for two hours. I have worked here for five years. Present perfect with four. She has lived here for 20 years. We have taught at this school for a long time. Alice has been married for three months. They have been at the hotel for a week. Since plus a specific moment, since this morning, since last week, since yesterday, since I was a child, since Wednesday, since two o'clock. I have worked here since 1990. Present perfect with since. She has lived here since 1980. We have taught at this school since 1965. Alice has been married since March 2nd. They have been at the hotel since last Tuesday. All right, now for this example, what we're going to do is we're going to write three sentences using since and three sentences using for. Both are going to be to express actions that have a duration of time in the discussion forum. Ready, let's go. La plataforma. Vaya, entonces voy a compartir la pantalla, permítame.
Roberto, ¿qué es usted? Méndez. Hernández. Hernández, ok. Ok. Vamos a hacer la de Ford. Va, eh... Primera, por. Sí. Uh, we have been in the city for five years. Okay. Hemos estado en la ciudad por cinco años. We have been. We have been. Uh -huh. Ya yeah, lo puse. Yeah. Sí, así, ¿verdad? Sí. Ah, ok. Puede ser. I have been in this job. For one three, three months or three months. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Y la tres. Um, Tú eres el chihas. Bien. Chihas. She has eaten. Ella ha comido. Um, vegetables, por ejemplo. Vegetables. Vegetables. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Vegetables. For. For the last year? Por el último año? No. O por, por el. Desayuno o por el almuerzo. Tienen vegetable for the breakfast. Breakfast. Por la comida. Breakfast. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok. Y el siguiente que es science. Science. Uy. Ciencia. <risa> Vaya. Este es como más específico, ¿verdad? Como... He has been... Mm, ¿Perdón? Yo he sido profesor desde 1980, digamos. I have been teacher science. 1980. Yo he sido profesor. Perfecto. Eh, Bien. Por ejemplo, si yo digo yo no he visto televisión desde marzo, digamos. I don't watch. Hey. TV science March. Science 
Things. Eh, Science, digo. Es que no. Things, ah, dijo el teacher. Things. Ajá. Vamos a ver aquí. Puede ser. We have been. Sí, hacen. Playing. Play. Podría ser esta. No tengo dudas con el verbo, porque aquí ahí puede estar un verbo en pasado. Nosotros hemos jugado básquetbol desde el último año, algo así. Sí, sí. sí ¿verdad? Se va. <ríe> vale, entonces ya está. No sé si le vamos a cambiar algo. No, ¿verdad? No. Ok, entonces lo voy a enviar. Ah, vaya. Ayer, I have not, haven't, I have not done what, yes. haven't, I haven't. I haven't watched. Ah, okay. I haven't, I haven't watched. Ah, pero el participio. Okay. ¿Cuál sería el participio de Watch? Espérame, quiero ver. Watch. 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 No lo hay. <laughs> All right, is everybody finished or do you need more time, guys? Finished, for sure. Everybody's finished. Thank you, Monica. Is everybody finished or do you need more time? More time, teacher. No, it's a fact. More time. Okay, so yes. if you are finished, you may continue. If not, you will have more time. Solo dos mil. Ok, dos mil. <ríe> Luego, he has traveled since. Twenty El tiempo, el año, o no sé. Perdón. Twenty qué me dijo o twenty. Has travel sign since. Sign. Twenty fifty. Twenty fifty. Sí. Luego. Ya está viajando desde. Desde qué. Es que le escucho 2015. Así es. 2015. 
Okay, oi sim. Pero eso no lo vamos a escribir en la plataforma. ¿o? Sí. ¿Cómo no? Ande. ¿Y a dónde lo estaba escribiendo? Yo en el cuadro. <risa> no, bueno, ya lo vamos a pasar entonces. Pero ya están, o sea. Sí, ya están, no sé. Vamos a empezar. In class since uh, five thirty p.m. Mm -hmm. And the last, the babies have cried, 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 cried mm -hmm. uh, for thirty minutes. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes. Oh. <laughs> yeah. All is correct. Congratulations. Uh -huh. Wow. Si gusta. Thank you, Enrique. Si gusta. Eh, las dicen entonces ahora ustedes. En Agua Chapa. You live in Agua Chapa. Y es cuánto tiempo vivo en Agua Chapa, hombre. All right, can I have one participant, one volunteer? Let me hear your examples. Okay, Edwin. Go ahead, Edwin, let me hear your examples. He has worked for 10 years. Excellent. Monica, let me have your example. Yes. I have worked for a uh, fine mom. Perfect. Excellent. All right, guys, time's up. Please continue working on the platform and we see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye, teacher.